I wanted to ask you guys uh, about Woodstock. Terry, were you in California? Yes. I was, I was doing the Blind Faith tour oh, okay. on the West Coast when, when Woodstock came along. Gotcha. So Bill was there, and a big crew was there as well. Yeah, we had literally eight or nine of us. He's out there holding, up, holding us together with Blind Faith, which is a pretty big act, <laughs> a very yeah. big act. And, uh, you know, I'm praying that it's going to go through because I'm buying stuff, extra stuff, and trying to get after they, you know, the only big mistake they really made there was the fact that, you know, and if, if someone asked me earlier how to cure it, I would have had the answer for them. But they, they had two 80-foot telephone poles that the roof was suspended from, if you remember the picture. Well... When they were kicked out of Walk Hill, someone, they loaded it back on a trailer and someone went around the corner and broke 20 feet off of one of the lamp on one of the lampposts. So instead of wrapping it with aluminum or steel jacket, say six feet long, and making it whole again, because the whole thing was, that pole was nothing but compression. It wasn't being pulled sideways. There was, counter, there was counterweights in the cement counterweights. The cables went up to the top of the, length, the poles and then come down and held up the trusses. Well, if you just put that back together again, you're all right. But what happened was, so it's supposed to be like this, all right? Here's the lamp post under my head. And they took and collapsed it like this. Well, you try holding pressure when you put your arm out straight like this. It's not going to hold up very much at all without breaking your arm <laughs> if you have a tie up. And that's why they couldn't get the, the television going or the, the Ida 4 because they had really worked hard to make it a good event. And uh, that's <laughs> the Woodstock. That was the major failure there. We made it through without a major pass all the way from one end to the other and you get runner-up Academy Awards for documentary sound. That's awesome. What were the highlights for you of that event? The highlight, making sure that everything was stayed going and there, were, there wasn't anything going wrong. You make sure that whatever could go wrong, you, you had your fingers on it. Did, uh, did the uh, weather affect that was, sound at all? No. It was our job. That, that, that was my contribution to society and we really started pushing that and that's that's what went down didn't make any money but we made a lot of people happy and <laughs> what can I say it's really neat yeah I, thank you it was a lot of work with this man. <laughs> <laughs>